there's three big changes happening in the ocean. They're getting warmer, they're becoming more acidic, and in some spots, less oxygen, they're becoming hypoxic. These are all really dramatic changes, and it's very possible that what we see right now may be the future. The sea lions, they're one of the best species we can be studying to really understand how the oceans work and how they're changing, and also they can help us figure out how we're gonna to adapt to those changes. There are five different species of sea lions. The biggest of them all is the stellar sea lion. A male stellar sea lion can weigh over 2,000 pounds. At the Open Water Research Station, we are testing hypotheses to explain why some populations are increasing while others are declining. Since the late 1970s, we've seen over an 80% decline in stellar sea lions. And we brought trained animals, and we've set up experiments so we can essentially control the environment. We can take them up into some really deep water and allow the sea lions to move in the ways that they do naturally. By working with them, we could get some insights into the lives and the decisions that sea lions make that we can use to interpret the data we're getting from Alaska, from British Columbia, and elsewhere around the world. Each year, we don't know if this is going to be our last year to keep this going or not. We do it on a shoestring budget. And as a result, our, our staff have also been looking, along with me, for other possibilities for money. One of our technicians noticed Red Seal Ale, and he put in a call. And the person that he spoke to was the head brewer for North Coast Brewing. I was always interested in the water and always interested in life in the sea and got my degree in zoology with the thought that I would one day work as a marine biologist. When we ended up here on the Mendocino coast, we started a brewery instead, and so it seems natural for us to support this kind of work. Eventually, we came up with the idea for North Coast Stellar IPA and put together the group that we plan to support, including Andrew at the University of British Columbia, the Marine Mammal Center in Sausalito, and the Noyo Center for Marine Science right here in Fort Bragg. Stellar IPA is it's a big hoppy beer, like you would expect an IPA to taste like. We use Chinook hops, which are a classic microbrew hop, and it's a very pungent, resinous flavor and aroma. We have our own hopping method that we use to dry hop the beer. It provides a nice aromatic component to the beer that you can get it in your nose really strong when you're, when you're sniffing, the, sniffing the glass. The beer is being distributed throughout our entire network in 22-ounce bottles and in kegs, so you can find it in restaurants and bars and hopefully in every street corner market. The relationship that we built with these animals is allowing people to get to know them in ways that we've never known sea lions before. And what the sea lions have been teaching us has expanded our knowledge about the entire North Pacific Ocean, and that's helping to conserve them in the wild. Our hope is that this really helps to raise awareness for what is a very serious environmental problem. Mm-hmm.